one's trying to do the intro. Come on, come on. <laughs> Yo, what is up, guys? I'm here today with a live reaction to Jojo! Episode 7, yo. Let's jump right into this, man. Except. Let's go. Is the volume up? I can't hear a thing. Don't tell me I broke my headphones. No! One sec, guys. Okay, I can hear it now. I can hear it. Isn't, um, Narancha's voice actor Deku, right? Or maybe, I hear someone familiar. Narancha, relax! <laughs> Talk about kicking a man when he's down. He has no head, yo. And we're still kicking him. <laughs> Playing football with him. <laughs> Yo, talk about like some gangster. Mr. Mike, I don't know. Yo, it looks like a seaweed. It is seaweed. I don't know where you're going with this, mister. <laughs> okay, I think I see where he's going. with the wrong one I don't even feel bad for him guys I'm sorry I can't feel bad for him he was gonna kill us I mean he didn't kill us yeah of course you know he didn't but still don't mess with us yo Capri this place looks beautiful Billion. Yo, I was told that that 10 billion is basically 5 million US dollars or 5 billion. I don't remember. It's one of those, yo. 5 million or 5 billion US dollars. So that's pretty a lot of money. I mean, pretty a lot of money. That doesn't even sound like proper English. I'm so sorry, guys. But let's go. I'm hyped, man. You already know what time it is. It's Friday. Let's relax. Get your snacks. If you're eating your snacks, you're probably already eating. But you know what I mean? Let's just relax and watch some JoJo greatness. Oh. Uh, and yeah, I, I definitely don't feel bad for that guy that attacked us. He gets what he gets. You know, even though they started going a little overboard, kicking his headless body and shit. Like, yeah, you want to mess with us? Don't mess with us. <laughs> Oh, that was incredible. Let's go. Look at the opening, so beautiful. Fourteen gold! Yeah, this opening looks too good. And it's like, you know, the thing I love about openings, especially from certain animes, like certain animes, I look forward to the openings. JoJo is one of them, because JoJo's opening forever changes, you know what I mean? Like, look at, what, part four's opening, how it changed throughout all the episodes and whatnot. You know what I mean? They change it a lot. So I love, 14 gold! Yeah, but they change it a lot, and I really love that. That's good. What about submarines? What am I saying? I sound like an idiot. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Mr.'s creeping me out a little bit. Like, just don't. <laughs> No. 
Oh, I'd run out! Oh! Oh, no! Oh! Oh, he got him in the island! Oh, ew! These guys are all some Satan shit! It doesn't work? How does it work? Did it miss the break it last time? Yo, what's going on? Yo, what the? <laughs> what? Yo, what dance moves are these? Yo! Yo! This is awesome! Look at- Bro, those dance moves were off the chain? You saw them? What, what was that? Like what? How they were doing the move? Oh, that was awesome! Wow, come on. Yeah, what? Really? Come on, man. Let me see, too. I mean, I'm seeing, but you know, let Jordan see what's wrong with you, man. Come on, let's get along, right? Oh, wow, he told our location. Look at that, he told everything. Kick his ass some more, step on his head, yo. That's actually pretty good to know, like they're waiting for us there. Okay, that's good. Yeah, you you know when you're a gangster or whatnot, or like you live with principle and a code, you won't speak. Oh, this is bad. I mean, we're all strong, though. We're strong? I don't know. But you see, the way the situation is right now. But that's so risky. No offense, Narancha. I know you're not calling Jorno stupid. <laughs> oh, love to Narancha though. But you, I, I know you guys get the joke.
have a dream. Once again with the line. Mister? What? Mister has a gun? Six pistols. Six pistols as in wait, isn't that like a band, the British band, right, or something like that? I know of them, but like I, six pistols, right? I think that's what it is. Yo, I can't wait to see Mr. Stan. We have to be very careful here. We could shoot the wrong person and kill them. Sausage? <laughs> what? How did you even have this set up? That's what I want to know. Where did you put it? Mister, you can't eat this another time. I get it. I, I respect it. You need to eat. You know, you need food to process and be able to be healthy and strong. Oh, they're so cute. Look at this. They're like, they're like there's multiple of them. You know what Stan this reminds me of? Kind of. Shigechi? You know how he had it, like his stand? Just a little bit though. <laughs> Yo, why are they picking on number five? Why number three punch number five for? As, but there's a number seven there. Or was that a number one and I thought it was a number seven. I like Mr. Stan, that's pretty cool.
definitely can't be this dude. No, that was a bad idea. This is too obvious. Yeah, th that's too hot. Like, no way. Look at that. And no one will head there because it's like one out of a, like picking a needle out of a haystack. These, all these guys look suspicious. Why do they all look suspicious, yo? means of connecting to him, you know, I was thinking that. I was gonna say it, but I didn't say it. I was gonna say he must have means of connecting to him other than here, like the watch house. Or is he in there? He's in there! Look at that. Dad, don't tell me he's gonna push him to a different, like, location. Look at that, that's freaking cool. So, like, Mr. can never miss then. Cause the bullets, I, I didn't even think about it like that. When they shoot, they can control where the bullets go, they can see. <laughs> That's so cute, man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Look at how Mr. just with the gun, like it's nothing. <laughs> Is 
Look, he's there! That's what I was thinking. I was like, why would he run? Isn't he a stand user? But then again, at this moment, you're scared, you know? We have to hop on? Is that him? comment like before there was like I hate when he gets so mad like when the episodes end guys I'm sorry but I can't control myself it's like you're watching this right and it's so good it's so good you don't want it to end and it's like it ends in the worst ways mister think about it the way this episode literally just ended mister sees face to face with this you know I don't even think that's the guy but they have the same hair color it looks uh, like you know and the guy he looks pretty scared as well so he meets face to face with this guy in the car and he shoots him eat lead so it's like that's not him I don't believe that's him you know what I mean so you're scared because you don't know like the outcome obviously mister you know shot him but still you don't know like the outcome and it's like Jorno should I feel like Jorno should have already been there like hey, what were you taking a lap or something like jogging a light jog like what's going on like you should have been there my guy I don't know but maybe I, you know I don't know like I said I just feel like he should have been there quicker a little bit but just that whole scene where you know the guy he's there he's on the radio and you have Jorno he's like yo you he's there he's there no mister don't let him see you and mister like he doesn't know because they can't hear each other so he's moving he's slowly moving and like the guy's right there at the window he sees mister he knows who mister is like he knows everyone in bruno's crew so he sees mister and he's like yo i have to leave closes the window curtain and mister shoots it you know i really like mister stan just the whole fact that you have these bullets right these six bullets supposedly but i saw a number seven bullet i don't know if that was a typo or maybe it has meaning, you know what I mean? It definitely should have a meaning, but yeah. I saw like a, it says like there's six bullets, but I saw a seventh bullet. Let me actually go back and make sure. Let me see it real fast. Cause I'm sure I saw seven bullets. I swear guys, I mean, I'm not gonna swear, but I, I saw seven. And like, I really like them. Like, it's like you have these six cute bullets and they're fighting with each other. Like number three is hitting everyone and whatnot. And Mr. Like, he's like a dad kind of thing. <laughs> You know, with like six kids, and he's like, stop, what did I tell you about hitting each other? Number three, cut it out. All right, let me just get it real fast. Sorry about that, guys. Let me just try to find this. But you see, the thing with Mr. Stan, even though it's really cool, all right, this is perfect. Yes, look, number seven. There's a seven there, right there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. One. Oh, I get it. So basically, he has bullets one, two, three, five, six, seven. He doesn't have a number four. <laughs> okay, I get it. Okay, I get it. I, I see why I saw seven bullets. There's literally six bullets, but he just doesn't have the number four. All right, that's actually pretty cool. <laughs> okay, I didn't even notice that. That's actually pretty cool. So, like, the whole thing with Mr.'s ability, I really like it. But I feel like it has a flaw to an extent. Cause like, let's say you're fighting... Let's see a good stand that I could think of. Let's say you're fighting Star Platinum, right? And you have a stand like Mr. You really can't, maybe that's too OP to say. But like, let's say you're fighting Koichi's stand or something. Let's think about it like that, right? 
Mister has to shoot you. I mean, but then again, Mister, he can choose where to aim the bullets, right? He has six shots, he can aim them to your vital points and you can die. So that's pretty, you know, like he can kill you. He can instantly kill you. But I feel like if he's ever fighting like with a close combat stand like Koichi, Star Platinum or something like that, he could lose because who's gonna, like if you're shooting, boom, 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 you shoot your six shots, your shots have to come back to you and whatnot, right? And if you miss, and he's close combat, he's fighting you, he's causing, I don't know, maybe, I'm not, you know, you guys, I don't know if you guys can see how I'm looking at things, like, imagine Mister, he shoots someone, right, or someone's just so fast that they can stop him from shooting, or move his hand with the gun kind of thing, if you can't get me, like, then it's like close combat with a stand, he would lose, wouldn't that be the case, because guns are more for, like, long range and medium range, so, if it's like, I feel like what Mister stand is good for, is like, assassination, like, something like this, how we had to sneak up on this guy and kill him or like if he knows his enemy ahead of time and like he sees his enemy or his enemy is far from him he can you know let off a couple of shots and it will get the enemy I really love the like you know sex pistols and just yo I love <laughs> number five just crying and shit like he just kept crying number three picking on everyone really like it I like seeing stands like that cause it's like you see there's all these multiple personalities and you know usually we get stands with like what one personality like we get um you know of course Let's say Magician's Red, for example. Just Magician's Red, no one else. But like I said, it really reminds me of Shigechi's stand. You know how Shigechi's stand was like. And I really like that. Man, another good episode of JoJo. Seeing Mr.'s ability. So basically, now we have to get this guy and then make sure we're good. Because he, you know, Zuchiro? Is that how you pronounce it? Zuchirio? Zuchiro? You know, the guy with the green hair. He, like, he told his friend, you know, where we are. So I don't know if he just told his friend or his friend transmitted this to someone else. I hope they just kept it between themselves. Because imagine the friend told someone else. And then we have someone else to deal with. But I really think, like, more people know about this. Like, many more people know about this than just those two. Yeah, but th that's pretty much what I think. This was a really good episode. Man, and then Mr. Eating Lunch, it's my lunch time, like what is it? Come on man, this is an important job, an important task on the line. You're trying to eat your lunch, trying to eat his supper. I get it, you need to eat to be, you know, to function properly, but at this moment? Yo, you gotta love the characters. That dance! Yo, you saw the what, what were those dance moves? Oh my gosh, the dance! <laughs> And it's like, you know, Narancha, he starts it off, Fuko joins, everyone's in the dance, enjoying themselves, I really love that. And it was like, it was so random, like I didn't even, like I'm just watching and I'm like, what is he doing? Is Narancha dancing? And you know, then you see Mr. like Mr. joins and I'm like, what's going on? You know, everyone just starts dancing and it's just so like, enjoyable, it's funny, and, but it's also like, wow. And how they were just picking on this guy, his headless body, kicking him and all this stuff, they were so ruthless to him. And Mr. hooking his eyelid. Oh my gosh. You know, you can see they censored it. Because when you looked at the eyelid, right? It was pure black inside. If it wasn't censored, you would probably see like red, like vessels and all of that. Like veins and all that. Oh, man. That would have been a gruesome scene. Think about it but yeah guys honestly this is everything right now like a very great episode i'm just gonna end this short so i can render this up faster for you guys and get it up there faster so yeah thank you so much for watching if you made it to the end you are amazing peace out